U.S. Senate, a little closer each day to deciding on Ukraine aid, Chuck Schumer. The U.S. Senate is continuing discussions on passing an aid package for Ukraine, Israel and Taiwan, and strengthening security on the U.S. southern border, according to Senate Democratic Majority Leader Chuck Schumer. Senate negotiators on both sides are working hard to approve another round of aid to Ukraine by finalizing our supplemental national security package. Senators are getting closer every day, and there are still issues to be resolved. But one thing is for sure, they will continue to do so. In his speech in the Senate, Schumer says that the last package of defense aid to Ukraine worth $250 million was announced almost a month ago, and since then, the U.S. government has not been able to send any support to Kyiv due to the lack of funding approved by Congress. According to him, since the beginning of the war, Putin has been betting that sooner or later the United States will surrender. The Senate must make sure that Putin regrets the day he questioned America's resolve, help friends who are fighting for their survival, and complete the addendum. Meanwhile, in his speech, Senate Minority Leader Mitch McConnell, a Republican, criticized President Joe Biden for not doing more to give our friends a decisive advantage against Putin's aggression and for not investing more seriously in restoring America's military strength. He says he was never misled as to why America supported Ukraine's struggle. It was never about charity. It is in the direct interest of the United States to prevent authoritarians from feeling entitled to rewrite borders by force. It is in their interest to help reduce the size of a majority enemy's army without sacrificing American lives.